Dallas Best Tex Mex. We have Jeff Frankel from Matito's Tex Mex. Thank you so much for being here. Good Appreciate morning. it. Yeah, the Thank tradition you. of Christmas Eve tamales. Mm -hmm. Easier said than done. Well, we are doing the uh, chili con carne sauce today yeah. to top them. It's uh, no tamale is complete without <laughs> the con carne sauce. All right, how do we do it? All right, so basically what I've done here is we've got uh, two and a half pounds of ground beef and it's been uh, braised and, and heated and then we put in water on top of that. We're going to be cooking that down. Okay. So while that's cooking down, okay. then what we've done is created a roux here, which is just uh, flour and water. Okay. And the roux is ready. And so now we pour the roux. Do I stir yeah, you, you, you stir okay. while I do that. And you're just, you're just cooking this down until the meat is cooked? Well, we're actually cooking out the water, so okay. it's a uh, gotcha. it's a long process. Basically, the water and the meat cooks for about 20 minutes, and then after the water and the meat have cooked, this will ultimately cook down for about 45 minutes. And then okay. what we're going to so also do while you're stirring... That gets thick pretty quick. It does, and then we're also going to add um, enchilada seasoning. Whoa! Oh, I know. We you're got not, all you're not shy, are you? No, no, no. This is uh, a lot of stuff that goes in here, and then it ultimately all cooks down. Wow, what oh. is that? This is um, ancho chili pepper. Okay, Ooh. wow. And then a little bit of salt. It's going to get loosened up here again in a second because we're going to put some tomato sauce. Okay. So actually, uh, these are pureed uh, tomatoes. So what we've done okay. is taken the tomatoes and pureed them. Now this is a, a based on a uh, recipe 50 years in the making. Huh? Yes, this goes way back a long time. So does every family kind of, like I'm Italian, so every family has their own sauce, you know, so same kind of deal here? Exactly. Their exactly. own little twist. Looks like a good one. So this takes about 45 minutes total, would you say? Exactly. So you get this stirred down and you can see it's kind of starting to get that nice brown yeah. look to it. And then it's going to cook simmer for about 45 minutes and then once it's done you're going to really end up it's going to look basically this is your final product right Yum. here and then uh, we've that taken uh, our beef tamales and we covered them with the sauce. Now while we take a look at that we should mention if you have not been to brunch at Matito's it is I mean they have the most epic buffet brunch there at their epic. new location. I mean epic, it's Steve delicious. <laughs> it is uh, don't and yeah. you, you guys have your new location. We right? do we're now at the corner of Oak Lawn and Cedar Springs. Yeah easy and, to see right there. A uh, huge restaurant. Yeah, it's, and, giant, it's enormous. And are you open? So you're open regular hours except closed Christmas we're day. We're closed Christmas day but we're open every day uh, throughout the holidays. Nice. Um, other locations of course uh, Forest Lane in Dallas, Main Street in Frisco, and also MacArthur in Las Colinas. Exactly. Same hours for all of the stores. If people want to go get some tamales, they can yes, do it. Yes, exactly. Okay, looks good. You can find this recipe and a link to Matitos on our website. Just look on the Good Day tab, and we'll be right back.